All right, guys, quick rundown here. Uh, looking to do full replacement, possible water heater as well. Uh, to give you a rundown, we are in a utility closet room here, just off the finished basement. Um, stairs, basement, floors will all need to be covered with tarps, and then it's just concrete in here. Um, quick rundown on the equipment. We've got a uh, uh, B-width, uh, both furnace and coil, 40 inches tall, all common sizes. Uh, the return drop is undersized at eight by 22. That'll need to go to minimum eight by 26, possibly 10 by 26. Uh, total height on that is 82 inches. We do have the room up there on the return if we need to bump that to the right uh, to get our April air filter in there. We're working with about, uh, not quite four inches. So we'll need to pick up three uh, and just move that return drop over. The line sets uh, appear to be uh, sized properly. We'll just need to do a pressure test on those once we clean them out, make sure they're holding pressure. Uh, flue is a common size, four inch, tying into a six inch T with a three inch from the water heater. That all need to be replaced. Gas line is also coming in from the left. We'll need new shutoffs and replace that track piping down there. Drains in front of the unit, the new vinyl there. As far as the water heater goes, uh, it's just a common 40 gallon, 40,000 BTUs. Uh, we do not have a pressure tank or any dielectrics. We'll need to bring all that out and pipe that in. And then we'll just need new shutoffs and everything. Um, uh, we do have combustible air vents. That's all up to code. We're good there.